On today's video, we're going to show you how to do Mirrorcast from an Android phone. So stay tuned. You have your Android phone. You wish your Android phone would play videos on your new NEX radio. You're in luck. The new NEX radios have... HDMI. That's right. Which is a key thing in order to get video off of these newer phones. Most of these newer phones have some form of copy protection built into them that prohibit video from just spilling out of the, the device. So, on the back of the NEX radio, now this is true for everything except for the 5100. If you have a 50 um, or 5200 for yes. that matter. Anything that starts with a 5 and it has NEX in it, take it back and get a 6, 7, 8, or a 4. Oh, wow. Okay, so anyways, the back of the radio. Yes. If you look right over here, this buried deep inside, this crevasse, is the HDMI input. That is what you're going to want. That's where you need to be. Now, Mirrorcast, which is what we're talking about today, is really cool because it's done with a dongle. Okay? And for those of you that don't know, a dongle is this. It's just a little goofy thing. It's got an HDMI on one end. Most of them come with some form of a little extension, which is cool. They need power, which you have to plug in via USB. Now, how do you power this? That's entirely up to you. If you're doing Android, that probably means you're not using USB 1 for anything. So you can plug it into there. Or if you'd like to be able to have USB 1 available for, let's say, a thumb drive to do music or something like that, just get one of those cigarette lighter gimmicks and plug this into that, okay? Yeah. It, it doesn't matter. You don't, you don't have to use it up. For the purpose of this demonstration, we're going to plug it into USB 1 just yes. to charge it to turn it on. So what you want to do is plug it into the back here. Oh, turn it the right side up. And we're going to plug it into here. All right, so pretty much that's the installation process. So this is something you're going to have to do in the dash. Um, so if you've already got it installed, you're going to have to pull it out and plug it in. Uh, or if you ran the HDMI cable, you'll have to get an adapter so that you can go from the male to the female. You'll be able to figure out your male and female parts, um, I hope. Okay. So. Now we're going to turn it around, power it up, and show you what you typically have to do next. If you go to the home page and click AV, you'll see the HDMI. Now typically after you plug in the HDMI cable, it takes about 5 to 10 seconds for this to actually turn from grayed out like these to a functioning source. So we've had it plugged in that long, we're going to go ahead and activate it. So now what's going to come up is your dongles menu. So this is a dual cast Wi-Fi dongle. Down here it has the IP address, has a pin number, which is right here, which is just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tells you what kind of dongle it is so you can look it for it. So now we'll go ahead and wake up our phone. So go ahead and go to your phone settings. Click on Wi-Fi. Click on the name of the dongle you're using. Then type in the password. connect okay so once you're connected you're pretty much done there get out of here now you're gonna go swipe down swipe down until you get into the settings of the phone you're gonna come over here where on your phone you need to get to your screencast now each one of these we understand is different so we're just going over the basic principles here go to screencast click on there click done. It's going to do its thing. It's going to take a minute. And there we go. We're now connected. So as you can see, it's going to do its thing. Come down, come up, come over here. You can go to YouTube. In this case, you want to rotate the phone. 
And there you go. Now you're watching your YouTube on your NEX radio. So anything that you could display on the phone, go ahead and turn that back up. And go back. Go home. Check out some Amplified. Down there. Go here. Now you're not going to be able to do anything from this, but you can have it displaying. And it's wireless. So you can do anything you want with this. And that is the magic of Mirrorcast. Now, dongles, there's a ton of them. If you go to Amazon and type in Mirrorcast, you'll see tons of dongles. Basically, what you want to look for is something with Wi-Fi built into it. Because you want to be able to connect to your phone via the ad hoc Wi-Fi network. So, unlike Chromecast or... Amazon Fire Stick, you need external Wi-Fi. This has Wi-Fi built into it. That's what allows us to pair to it. We're not paired to the internal store's Wi-Fi for anything other than this phone doesn't have service, so we need it to connect to the internet. But you don't need it to make this pair. Now, Belkin makes the, the unit that we like to use. Yeah. Um, we'll have a link to it in the show notes if you'd like to pick one up. Like we said, this is the dual unit. Um, hmm, you know, whatever. It's cheap. Yeah, I mean, obviously it'll do what you want. So I'll put a link to the show notes for that one too, just in yeah. case. Hey, you know, that'll give you choices. Who doesn't like choices? <laughs> All right, guys, this is Mirrorcast. This is Android only. Uh, I will tell you for you iPhone guys, if you're still watching, for whatever reason, um, doesn't work. Uh, the iPhone. The only thing you can stream is movie trailers and Hulu. Everything else locks it up. Sucks to be the iPhone guys today. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Okay. All right. So. so by all means. Wow. Well, thank you for watching. You guys can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. And we hope you enjoyed this as usual. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and we will get back to you. Otherwise, you guys have a great night. Subscribe if you like us. We do enjoy that so much. Um, you guys have a great night. We'll see you later. Bye.